are y'all doing today on this red granny stitch afghan for cruise yes so you know by now that I've gotten up and I've realized what time it is what day it is and my name <laughs> very very important to name very important and I do have some things on my list today to uh, <clears throat> take care of because today is Friday but I want to share with you I know I'm just a show off kind of person <laughs> but I got a box in the mail yesterday now I was told the box was coming Miss Gigi hi Gigi I got your box now what do you say? What did you get in that box? Well, let me show you what I received. This is my happy mail. <laughs> That's what everybody's calling mail that we receive like this is happy mail. Well, I've got some labels in case I need to mail some, some of my projects to someone. I've got labels. She sent me, or either that, there were some of hers and she forgot she left them in the box, didn't you, Gigi? <laughs> and then, I got this wonderful, have you ever done these books? They're so much fun, especially if you're down, you know, and you're not feeling up to par and your arms are so tired or you hurt so bad you just can't seem to do anything but you need your mind to be on something why this is it and it's fun too you don't have to be down in in the dumps or your body down in the dumps you can do this anytime just to have it over coffee first thing in the morning just get your mind working and this is bible theme game tablet it's 48 pages and i love it it's got the word search search and the dot game and then if any kids come over to visit you <laughs> i can say oh you want to connect the dots <laughs> so it's a really cute thing plus you can color the pages with colored pens and pencils too which is always a lot of fun i never did win at tic-tac-toe i'm not very good at tic-tac-toe i figure that the one who starts is the one who ends <laughs> wins I mean the one who starts is is the one who wins that's what I'm trying to say but I don't know that that's always true <laughs> but it has been for me it has been for me thank you Gigi and I want to show you this is this not absolutely beautiful look at that beautiful trim you know you can put that on the top you know a headband I don't know if you could appreciate it being a headband yes I guess you could yes you could or maybe a wristband glitter on it. I'm sure, you know, blue is my signature color. <laughs> Thank you, Gigi. That is very pretty. You know who made this? Did you make this, Gigi? It's very fine work. Very good work. Beautiful. I love textile works. That's really quite beautiful. And you know, Clyde's out there barking because he's knowing I'm making a video and talking to you guys today. <laughs> and I got a little red bag. And in the red bag, 
me a second. I've got sweeteners from Community Coffee. Red and Bigelow Red Raspberry Herbal Tea Orange and Spice Herbal Tea <laughs> and Herbal Tea. <laughs> no, it's orange and spice orange and spice, red raspberry, Splenda sweetener and herbal tea to your delight. Beautifully balanced blend of zesty citrus and luxurious spices you know it always surprises me how long you have to keep them uh to steep you know what they don't call it steaming steep steep tea yes there's an art to it too to get to get the most out of your tea those english people well a lot of americans now uh, but, you know, tea's been around a long time, and uh, tea's not always out of the things we think tea should be made out of, you know. I, I do believe that there was tea made from dandelions and all kinds of flowers that you can get in your walking through a field. You can harvest and forage. Of course, I don't know which ones they are, but there are people that do, and they know the benefits of tea. Thank you, Gigi. Bye. And I got a bookmark. It says, books are a summary of human's knowledge. Tradition books, no, nutrition books in the world. Light your life. Thank you. You know how much I read. So, you know, I never can have enough uh, bookmarks. But, you know, a lot of my bookmarks get away from me. I think they get back to the library and some of the books I'm reading. You know, of course, I don't know if I'll leave them in there, how, how that happens. But it happens, let me tell you. I used to have a bunch of crocheted um, bookmarks that a friend made me delicate, beautiful. I don't think I have one left of all she made me, which is sad on my part. I used to just keep them in my Bible, but then I started putting them in my book. Oh, and I got a sweet little heart. That's a crocheted heart. Look at that. Can you see it? I'll show it to you. See? Isn't that pretty? It's crochet heart. Put that on a clothesline, not clothesline, but a fishing line, and suspend it from the bottom of your curtains over your sink. Wouldn't that be cute? Or a Christmas ornament. I imagine you could make that with a bookmark. Yeah. Put a ribbon on it, and it could be a bookmark. Thank you, Gigi, for making that. That's a different pattern. I like that pattern. Yeah, I like that. <laughs> Be busy. Do what you love. It's a magnet. Look at this. And it's got a little honeybee on it. Do you see it? Little honeybee. Two little honeybees. And they're trying to get in that jar of honey. <laughs> Bless the hearts. They're so desperate they're trying to get into jars of honey. Do what, Doing what you love. I love that. I'll treasure that. I, you know how I want everybody to support our little bees. So important. My sister saw that and she wanted to. She says, isn't that cute with the little bees? I said, yes. Oh, looky here. Isn't this sweet, guys and girls? Look, it looks real. Look at the eyes. Can you see the eyes? You can't.
can't see them, can you? Lighting isn't quite right for it. But the eyes, they're little brown eyes. See? Cute, cute, cute. Really pretty. wonder who made that. That's gorgeous. That'll go up there with my bluebirds. You'd be right there. You're about the size of my bluebirds up on the shelf, too. Yes, you are. And I love the blue. That's my signature color. You sit right there for right now. Yeah. Don't want you to break off your beak. I'm the worst for breaking off the beak. <laughs> <laughs> and looky, looky, looky. <laughs> hello, hello, hello. I'm Mrs. Frog. She got her lipstick on, too. <laughs> I'm going to name her Gigi. I name you Miss Gigi because you've got this smile on your face. Da -da 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 -da. <laughs> I'm going to sit you up here where I see you every time I make a video. Yes, I'll sit you up here on my little table. Right by my coffee puff cup. That is so sweet. But there was one more thing in the box, guys and girls. And let me... This is something. Okay, you you know. Okay, let's see if I can get find it here. Yeah, I can't miss it. Know what this is? No, it's not ear ear things. You know, put on your ears. No, 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 so you can hear music or something. See those little things right there? Now, I know you smarty pants, y'all already know what this is. But you put it on your neck. Of course, I got a big head and a fat, short neck. But if you turn it on, it's an air conditioner, kind of. It's a fan. Oh, it tickles your ears. <laughs> I may have it upside down, but I like the way it tickles my ears. But it's a little fan, and it's got three different speeds on it. Let's see. Three different speeds. I don't know where my button is now. There it is. And you can go faster. Can you hear it? And then you can even go faster than that. You can't hear me. I'm a plane taking off. <laughs> Isn't that not wonderful? You know, in those hot days, wouldn't that been nice to have that? Ooh. So then, if I'm in my airplane necklace, <laughs> that's what it sounds like, I can put on my lights to crochet or take off. Then I can get my crocheting. I feel like I'm having to yell. <laughs> So, I'm ready. Let's fly to Indiana. <laughs> oh, maybe we'll fly to New York City. Florida. Hey, we can go to Florida. We can go to Minnesota. We can go to Chicago. We can go to Detroit. We can go to Texas. We can go to Montreal. We can go to Minnesota. Oh, you tall. You're up. Scotland. Let's go. <laughs> Isn't life fun? I mean, really. I can sit right here and pretend I'm on a flight. Got my. I can hear my plane running, although it is cool. It's very cool. It works very well. And it's not run on batteries, I don't think. I think it's just uh, you plug it in. Uh, uh, like you do the light to charge, you know, this light here to charge. Now this light, you know, too, you know, <laughs> you put it down here so you can see, although I'm missing, it's better, like, you know, Gigi did a video on how she does hers, and, so it shoots right to directly on what she's working on, so you can see it at night, but isn't that cool? Thank you, Gigi. Let me see if I can get my lights off here for landing. There we go. 
Got her lights off. Got her landing gear, gear down. And we're going to take off our... Isn't that cool? Look at that. Got a little button here that makes it... And it's very cool. It really is. It's called Arctic Air Freedom. And you charge it with a little... Where is it? I saw that somewhere. Here it is. A little tiny charger there. See it right there? You just plug it into the wall and it charges. Very, very cool. And uh, she sent me uh, where you can get this. I'll put the information in the... Um, you can get them at Walmart. Well, I guess you can get them about anywhere on Amazon. But it's very cool. And I prop, even though it's chilly, cooling down the temperature here, I'm sure still we're going to have hot days and I'm going to enjoy this. Although it might be soothing to have that, it'd almost be like a quiet air. You know, that quiet air, they, they buy this thing to sit by your bed so you sleep with quiet air. But anyway, thank you, Gigi. Thank you. I feel like I could go out of space now, which sometimes I think I already am. <laughs> Hope y'all are all doing well. And oh yes, and before you before you go, <laughs> I got this in the mail. And it's a butterfly. I think it's a hair piece. Uh and I, I will wear it in my hair, I know. But I didn't have enough room today, but I wanted to wear it since it's so pretty. And uh, it's my head, now that's my polka dot headband. And this is leather straps and balls and stuff. It's a, a very, very nice necklace. But of course, I turned it into <laughs> airband. Can you see it? Let's see if I pull it down here. I'll show it to you. See? a necklace and it's leather and beads and they're very pretty of course it's longer than it is on my hair so I have it wrapped up but anyway it's very very pretty I've got a dress I think that's a go with pretty 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 and my sister was uh, cleaning out her um, jewelry you know, disposing of it to her granddaughter or take him to a Goodwill or something. And I noticed, uh, I think Maribel, I think it was Maribel, said she was going through some of her jewelry and passing it on. Or maybe it was Bonnie. Maybe it was Teresa. <laughs> Wish I could remember. Now, I know who you are. Now, don't get me wrong. Don't get me wrong. I just don't remember things as well as I used to. But anyway, I'm going to have to get Clyde in here. Just a second. <laughs>